reserve fleet. There we go. Oh. Thank you. I need them in... Well, I need this in active fleet. Look, I can't afford this. Nice. It's only six months until we have another Dreadnought. Look, mate. Can't do it. Stop hammering me about it. I can't help it. Right, we'll threaten Austria. Uh... Threaten Italy. Already oh, kicked the asses of Italy. Yeah. Need more. Um, nice. Uh, definitely need more. Lovely. Submarines. Hmm. In fact, a bunch of these ones could be quite nice. Yeah. I need them for defense, really. So we'll build 20 submarines. Okay, it's 1923. Lovely. Hmm, I really don't want to do that. I'd piss off Germany and I can't do that. Hmm, yeah. Don't you stood right? Sure. Hmm. Oh, lovely. Right. Let's take a look at the light cruiser then. So look, we can have the actual torpedoes up here now. Lovely. Uh, hmm. Can I go for seven inch? I could go for a larger one. Hold on up an armor. Do I even have access to oil? No, so there's no real reason to make that an oil pile. Yeah. Wow, that's actually... The hell? Oh, it's because it's. God damn it. Hmm. That's a little silly. Ah. I'll just clear them all then. Midship. So I could have a very, actually very upgunned. Yeah, wow. <laughs> That's not bad at all.
like hardly any belt, so I'll reduce the belt armor. Oh, sorry, reduce the speed and increase belt armor. Is it because it's got the big guns? I think it's because it's got the big guns. Oh, it isn't actually. Be 8,000 tons. I'll drop that down to that. There we go. So I could have a nice, really nice, actually, little thing. I mean, it'd be able to do 28 knots. It's hard with a hell of a lot of torpedoes. It's got quite a lot of guns. Uh, these are very decent guns. These are 8 inch guns. So they're considerably good. 15,400 yard range. I like the Navarro. Okay. I'm going to Navarro into development. It's going to be an excellent. Alright. Go for the win. Submarine's coming into service now. There we go. So we look at um, Italy. They have 13 submarines. We have 26. Uh, we have 28 destroyers, 1 MS. They have 3 MS, 6 destroyers, 2 light cruisers, 1 dreadnought. We have 2 dreadnoughts, 4 battleships. So we're actually getting to a point where we are fairly formidable. I could actually align with them. Yeah, that's a good idea. In fact, it actually is. Hmm. Right, destroyer. Oh, actually, I'll go with some AMCs. AMCs could be very nice to have. They don't need to be anything good. And actually, I think they can carry mines, yeah. Weight remaining. That's a hell of a lot of weight remaining. Could have extreme range. Extreme! I have no idea how you do AMCs. I'll have them casemates. Actually. I don't know. Does it really even need to be? Right, AMC cannot have above 21 knots. Reliability, then, I guess. Okay, sure, why not? It's a weird little thing that I've never really considered building before, but hey. Rather expensive to build, too. Only takes about four months to build, though. 
So that's something you can build in times of war. Right. Never some for bows on heavy cruisers. Yep, I'll take those. Ooh, yes. Yep. Nice. So I'll design a new uh, generation of destroyer. Yeah, that's triples. Da 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 da. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, let's go for that then. Um. Yeah. Uh, Cole, though. Another knot of speed would be incredibly hard to get, so I'll just uh, give it some more ammunition. Actually, I'll knock off a few rounds just so we have some weight spare. A little. They're actually rather expensive destroyers. Four to build one. I could do with actually, um, yeah, uh, going through and updating my old ships. Right, so Germany has two dreadnoughts. Austria has two dreadnoughts. Great Britain has nine dreadnoughts. Italy one, France one, the USA four. Okay, yep. So Great Britain is definitely killing it here. Uh, they're actually in line with the vast majority. So I'll probably try and put another Dreadnought into service soon. Right, 1925. The regular game is over. If you want, you can continue playing, but technical develop will level out and some functions may not work properly. If playing too long on 1925, you can continue to do... There will be a hard cut off at 1950. Uh, we shall play on. Yes, I'll take that. Da 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 da. Hmm. Da 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 Clear the turrets. There we go, 37,000 tons. Okay, all or nothing. Okay, much too heavy. So these would be triple thirteens. Um, so seventeen point five. See, yeah, the twelves are actually a lot better. Yep. 
This is why gun quality is really important. Look at that. We can have smaller guns that are actually lighter. But they are going to perform a hell of a lot better. Incredible. Right, midship. I could have a um, double. Well. Potentially. If I go to short range, I could. Kind of a bunch of ammunition. Uh, so there we go, we could have the Ar Argonauta. Have I now got that secondary? Really irritating. Hmm, yeah, that would do for me. So we'd have some really nice... So that's 3, 6, 9, 12, 14, 12 inch guns, 24,200 yard range. Uh, so 20,000 yards we could penetrate 8.1 inches of armour. Yeah. 5,000 yards would be very, very deadly, but we do not want to ever get that close. Uh, so most combat would probably take place at about... Mm, probably that range. Most likely that range. There we go, so we'll put that into uh, existence. It's going to cost me a hell of a lot. I should be able to make... Yeah, I should be able to do that. And the virus finished working up. Um... Okay. Ooh. Battleship. Hmm. Oh. Well, that sucks. Improve sevens. Hmm. Okay, I can't afford this now. So we're going to have to uh, bring this down just to reserve. Hmm. Right, we'll hold, hold that just for the time being. Let's gain a bit of cash. Sure, hungry. There we go. Ah, nice. Nice boost to the budget there. Okay. Six additional cruisers. I could try for free. That's going to be insanely costly in the long run. Uh, Great Britain. Oh, for God's sakes. I mean, Italy is the weakest power here. Good. There we go. Nope. Alright, so this is Austrian. Yep. Yeah. Um, eight six inch guns, yeah. So we're gonna have a hell of a lot better cruisers. It's easy to say. Hmm. An Avara class in 19 months now. Nah. Right. Prob 
probably Germany. Oh. Hmm. Probably a swing. Again. Uh, these cruisers are going to be ready in a moment. Yep. Nice. Accelerate construction. Oh, sure. The San Miguel. Right, so I can put that to normal. Alright, so I'll halt that one and continue with the other one. Um, all right, we'll move the new Navara class to the Mediterranean. Hmm. Where the hell am I allied with? Oh, come on. What do you want? Oh, yes. Alright, we'll put the dreadnoughts to active. Hmm. Right, active, 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 active. Nine months away. Hmm. Go for the win. Um. I don't care, I need to get this ship out there. Probably France. Right, halt it for the time being, just so I can make some cash. Alright. Hmm. Oh. Oh, thank God. So close to war here. Good. Just got that, so it's in workup now. Right, mobilize. Hmm. I can't have war with Germany. I can afford war with Austria. Mm, then again, they do still have three dreadnoughts, two battle cruisers, a lot of actual submarines. They're actually quite formidable. 
Ay. Hmm. So I've only lost that many, apparently. Yeah, so theirs are fairly modern, and that is a scary thing. So I really don't want to go to war against either of the Germans. Right. She's finished all working up. The Brooklyn. That's fairly powerful. This is apparently obsolete. Hmm. So at the moment, uh, twenty thousand yards, twenty two thousand yards. Okay. Yep, there we go. Look how much better that is. Interactor. God damn. Increase armor slightly. Yeah, that's good. In fact, that's actually really costly. I might be able to afford that. I am being quite... Wait, what? Why? What? <laughs> what? No! Ah, god damn it. Actually, in fact, I really don't have time. Uh, so I'm going to evade here, and uh, should people want to see more, then we will continue in the next episode. So we'll leave this battle. I, yeah. Oh, she's gonna be tough. But we do have Sardinia, so that's another two naval bases there, which is really bloody nice. I do appreciate that. Okay. Yeah, so they're big ships, that's what I've got to worry about. So we'll have to test uh, Spanish Zil against Austrian Metal. Hmm. Probably gonna lose. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Probably. Okay. That will be over shortly. There we go. Well, they only had a light cruiser, but I did not want to get involved in that. Right then, guys, until next time, thank you for watching, and um, I shall see you in the future. Goodbye for now.